I'm the Five Minute Professor, and today's What I Think Wednesday is about something distressing that happened to me today. I was with a group of people, and they were talking about the metric system. Yeah, they mentioned that there was a movement in the 1970s to make the metric system the standard system for weights and measures in the United States. And I realized, when they said it, that they were talking about history. They were talking about something that they heard had happened. I was in a room full of people, and I was the only one of them that remembered Mrs. Johnson Drawbridge's fourth grade class on the metric system. When Mrs. Johnson Drawbridge assured me that we were going to the metric system. It was going to happen because it made sense. Damn, doesn't it make sense? Pints, ounces, teaspoons. Who needs this when you can use milliliters? Milliliters make sense. Centiliters, liters, decaliters. This makes sense. Units of 10, like our fingers. For goodness sakes, the metric system makes an enormous amount of sense. But... We're not going to the metric system. Why is that? Because we're Americans. Because for some reason, we have this weird association that things do not change. We believe that things are the way they are because they should be that way. Because a foot is 12 inches and a yard is 36 inches. Not a meter. Oh, for God's sakes, that's terrible. A meter. Or that a mile would be 5,280 feet. Does that make any sense to anyone, anywhere? No, it doesn't make sense. Almost as much sense as being in a room full of people where I'm the only one who remembered that we actually did learn the metric system in school like it was something we were going to use because it was important and easy. Easy. Why, why can't we use it? I mean, it was created around the time of the start of this country. And in fact, the metric system was used in the French Revolution. It was thought to be a less imperial system. Who knew? So, now, uh, Antoine Lavoisier, who's also responsible for isolating hydrogen and oxygen, uh, came up with the metric system and a, a, a metric unit of time uh, or he helped to refine it at least, uh, and he was eventually killed by the by the by the French Revolution. So that wasn't good for him. But the, I don't think we'd all be killed by the French Revolution if we adopted the metric system. That's really what I'm going with here. Is I think it's a good idea, and I think we would not all be guillotined if we did it. Perceptum, quispium, damnitium. Learn something, damn it. I'm the 5-Minute Professor, and thank you very much for listening to today's lesson. If you have any comments at all, please put them in the comments section down below. And of course, like it and subscribe to the channel. But most important, if you liked it, if you commented, and if you subscribed, tell your friends. Perceptum, quispium, damnitium. Learn something, damn it.